Hi food lovers, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm cooking with my girls. We're going to have a simple cookout of some few dishes like pilau, chicken. got my tomatoes i got my onions i have my washed rice i have my minced garlic and ginger paste i marinated my chicken earlier then now i have the spices and i have some potatoes here then i'm just going to like cook the chicken today we use the broiler that's why i've started with this process Just make sure you've put all the chicken so that they can get that nice flavor from the onions and the garlic. I'm still with my girlfriends here with a lot of gossip. I've just had to like mute them a while so that they can cook. Then you can add the garlic and the ginger paste. You can now like just try and spread it so that at least all the chicken can get coated with it. It gives a very nice flavor. Then you can add your black. So I also used paprika. You can also just add half a teaspoon then gram masala. And while well, you're free to add any type of spice you want, then once you're done, just gently mix so that the spices can get to coat all the chicken. Oh yeah, it smells so good. So now I'm just going to get my tomatoes ready. I just want to blend them. And I'm going to add my blended tomatoes. Actually now, I'm not going to add any water. The tomatoes will just cook through until when they are done and my chicken will be ready because I just want it with very little. You can now cover and simmer for about 10 minutes. Remember we are making broiler so it gets cooked very fast. Meanwhile I'm going to now cook my pilau. I'm going to add one cup of water to my meat so that it can boil and get tender because this is what I'm going to use for my pilau.
Well, once the water is finished, you can now add your cooking oil, then add your onions and just make sure you cook them to golden brown. Don't burn the onions. Just cook them to golden brown so that it can bring that nice color on your pilau. Then you can now add the garlic and ginger paste to the already cooked meat. You can see it has a very nice golden brown color. Now it's time to add the spices. I normally use my pilau masala, which is already grounded. All the spices are mixed in this one. But you can use also the whole pilau masalas, which you just have to like blend them. But they just serve the same purpose. <laughs> my girls are also just here behind me. Well, one of them is going to come and introduce herself. Then I'm going to just add the... Um, Tomato paste. My chicken is now ready. I'm just going to turn off my stove so that you can now concentrate with our pilau. Well, now I'm just going to add my rice. I've used two cups. Then I'm just going to mix it. Well, I'm going to add hot water. I'd already boiled water before, so I'm going to add hot water. And this is just the little soup, the broth that was left when I was boiling the meat. So I'm just going to mix it and cover it for about one hour. And it should be ready. Then now, it's never complete without potatoes. I'm going to use my double grill pan. I've just put some little oil. Then I'm going to put my potatoes there.
so to give it that nice taste i'm going to add also some onions to it then i'm going to add black pepper i'm going to add some soy sauce then i'm just going to cover it and just let it cook Well, I already had some pre-cooked rice, so I'm just going to make a uh, vegetable rice. So I'm going to just fry my onions, then later add my diced papers. I've used green paper, red paper, and I've used the yellow one. So I'm just going to mix it, and you can add any spice of your choice. I'm going to use black paper, I'm going to use some salt and beef cube. And now I'm just going to add in my already cooked rice to the veggies. This should just take less than five minutes. is already cooked so you have to gently mix it so that it doesn't have to like crush in between Since we love sausages, we had to also do it. Well, we're done with wow. cooking. Thanks for joining us when we're cooking our girls out food. So we are going to now serve. Then we show you what we have prepared today. Thank you. Keep it right here. Yep, yep. Setting up the table is one of our best hobbies as friends. Well, I want to thank my best friend, Shiko, for coming through. I want to thank Diana for hosting us. Then I also want to thank my friend Miriam for coming through so that we can make this work. So we're just going to set the table, then later just serve the food, eat, have some wine and have fun.
Well, the food is ready. We've actually just served. We're about to like sit down and enjoy. Well, guys, thanks for cooking with us today. It was something different, which I'm going to be doing every once a month, cooking out with friends, different dishes. Thanks, and don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Also, follow me on TikTok, on Instagram. Well, it's time for us to have fun. The girls are ready, and we're just ready to have it on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at our baby girl.